Welcome to the Vintage Coach Classic Pouch Bag Tour. So this particular bag, um, I estimate, was made in the 1970s. It was made in the original New York City factory, and I believe the style number um, would be 9170. The creed actually on this bag predates um, style numbers. It doesn't even have um, a serial or style number punched below the creed so um, it's an older bag it's one of the older vintage bags and it's this lovely um, kind of burnt orange rust color um, it's a really beautiful color it almost like doesn't do it justice on camera but it's really beautiful I'll, I'll also have um, the Etsy listing link below and you can kind of maybe get um, a better idea of the color in those photos Right now, um, when I'm taking this video, it's kind of overcast today and the lighting isn't really the best, so um, it's kind of hard to accurately pick up the vibrancy of the of the color, but it's a really beautiful um, rust color. And anyway, so I'll go ahead and give you a 360 of the bag now so you can see it from all angles. So here's the side. And the back, this one doesn't have a pocket. This is just a straight across seam. And as you can see, um, you can see some marks and a little bit of color variation and some patina throughout, which is pretty normal for, you know, obviously a bag of this age, probably about 50 years old. Um, does have a spot here on the um, strap. It's got these nice um, brass buckles, adjustable straps. And um, it's got a one-sided hang tag. It's got this nice suede-like texture on the other side of the hang tag. And then, um, as you can see, it's got some more spots and a little bit of discoloration and patina throughout on the front flap here. And then this, of course, is a flap. You can open it. And it's got a nice slip pocket here. Pretty deep pocket. And then... I stuffed it with paper to keep the shape looks like on the inside. So it's got a little bit of wear, but not too bad. And then you can kind of see the creed actually. Exposure is going all weird on my camera, but um, you can see the creed inside there. And you can see it's made in the, it's made in New York City. And there's um, this creed predates, you know, the style numbers, like I mentioned, or the serial numbers. And then it's got a zip pocket here. But um, the little part of the zipper pull is, came off or is missing, so. But it still works, the zipper. There's another look inside. It's pretty clean inside. So. That's what the bag looks like. So I'll go ahead and um, give you one more quick view of what it looks like on my mannequin so you can see what it looks like as a shoulder bag. So here's what it would look like as a shoulder bag. And then you could also wear it as a crossbody bag, which is my personal preference. Um, I think wearing bags crossbody, if possible, is a little bit more comfortable. So, um, there you go, that's what it would look like. And then also, as I mentioned, um, the straps are adjustable, but it does have some kind of like indents um, just because of the age. I'll kind of show you right there. So I probably wouldn't recommend adjusting the strap um, just because that would show. So it is adjustable, but probably looks better just leaving it the way it is because of the age and the indents. But anyway. That's what it looks like. Um, I'll link it below, of course. And um, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.